Hey guys, I've got another video here for you. Today I'm going to be showing you some of my favorite spots to snipe in our airsoft field. So let's get right into it. One of my favorite spots is right here in this little half triangle fort. And the reason for that is you can look out all the way to the other side of the property with the exception of this tree right here in the way. But other than that, you can see clear to the other side and you've got this wall right here protecting you if you need to reload. And then also protecting right here is this little pile of logs and you can use that to snipe over and then if someone starts shooting at you, you can duck down again. And with this tree right here in the way, if you really need to get out of a bad spot, you can just run over to the other side, find another fort, maybe up in that tower right there. It's a pretty quick escape route. One of the best spots I find is on the opposite end of a property from the first fort I showed you. It's right over here by the road. It's not so much protected by solid barriers, but it's on this little hill right here in the corner and it's also got these ferns. And those will kind of conceal you from this side of the forest. And then over here, you've got a clear shot all the way up to the top of the property, including the fort that we just built for the fort building contest that I had with Khalifas. And you can see right down here with the sniper, uh, if you were laying down, it would be really easy to pick people off. And you're also on the little slope right here on this little hill, so you'd be a little bit harder to hit since you're on the down slope on this side and also they're shooting you at the up slope from that side. I should take you to the next spot which is right there under this fallen tree and that's probably one of my favorite spots. So when this tree grew out it bowed out this way so it actually left a perfect little spot when the, this limb fell. There's just this little alcove right here that you can shoot out from underneath and it would be pretty hard to be shot at and you could even pile up some leaves in front so they wouldn't be able to see you as well. And this way, when you're way back here, or even further back, it would be extremely hard to tell that someone was under there. I've got two more spots to show you, this being the second to last. And this one right here looks out to the other end of the property, going down that way, and you're pretty well protected as well as camouflaged by all of the stuff that's right here in front of the gun. As you can see here, especially with the camouflage I put on the gun, it's pretty hard to see except for the orange tip. But you probably shouldn't cover up your orange tip just for safety reasons, as you all should know. And from further away, it's still going to be pretty hard to see, especially right now in the dead of winter when these leaves are still around. There's some orange in there, so it's not terribly noticeable. If you want, you can stay in this fort, but if you need to get another angle, you can come over here to this spot and just camp up anywhere on this little hill and see out not so far but at least into the groves of trees right down there all right guys this is going to be the last spot and probably one of my favorites of all the ones i've shown you so far you can come in to this tree right here and this is right behind the big tree fort and you can get in here and crouch down over this little knot of a root ball and look out in both directions or you can get into this little grove of saplings right there and I've used that spot multiple times in battles and there's enough room at the bottom to see out but a lot of people most of the time can't see you when you're lying down behind these trees so it's a really good spot. The one disadvantage is right here where there isn't a tree uh, you can often take fire from two directions at once so it's good to have another person on your team to cover this side and the game type I played where I use this spot a lot is we have two snipers on this side of the field and then everyone else trying to kill the snipers coming from that edge over. I think that's going to be it for today, and as always, 